Ends 500 meter sprint. Simon Albrecht on the inside. Lucas Silva Santibanez of Chile next to him. Juan Guzman of Venezuela in the third berth. And Andres Jimenez of Colombia on the outside. knows what it is to win a gold medal at the 2017 World Games picking up the 300 meter time trial gold is he about to make it double gold for Germany from Chile winner of the second semi-final today 500 meters please welcome Lucas Silva Santibanez and Lucas Silva Santibanez stunning everybody coming from nowhere to win that second semi-final and an extraordinary finish that ran out the two Frenchmen. Juan Guzman. Again, not a favourable draw for him. But he's gritty and rugged. And if it gets physical, he's very well placed to look after himself. And Andres Jimenez. Another outside draw for him. And he came through an amazing semi final as well from the outside. And he get himself on the podium from the outside in this final. Four high class competitors, one elite athlete on the inside, you would think. Simon Albrecht against the three South Americans, the men's 500 meter sprint final. Away they go. Who's going to get to the first bend? Now out of it, it is of course Albrecht. And he's got the Colombian tucked in just behind him, or just the rather the Venezuelan tucked in behind him. The Colombian now coming around the outside, and Santi Banez, as he did in the semi-final, lurking with intent right at the back. Remember, he came from there to win that semi-final. But here we are at the bell, and it's Albrecht. The Colombian moving into second place, but then there's a collision there. The Venezuelan getting in the middle of it, and out goes the Colombian. So here's our one, two, three, you would think. Only one winner, Simon Albrecht, dominant again. Somehow, Juan Guzman managed to keep his balance to contain a place on the podium as well. But it's all about this man. What a performance. Simon Albrecht. Holding off Juan Guzman and Lucas Silva Santibanez edging out Andres Jimenez as well to take the bronze. But really, the quality of this man is just extraordinary. All the action again was going on behind him. Olbrecht never challenged, never threatened, always in complete control. Well, he skated in two competitions he's picked up two gold medals and he's done so seemingly effortlessly there was all sorts of drama going on behind him Guzman and I think Jimenez collided at one point that helped Santibanez sneak through and put himself into a place now there's Jimenez looking to attack from the outside Guzman has got himself really well placed. Santibanez just tucked in behind them as well. And suddenly, it seemed there, that's that's uh, the little move there that Guzman made, and that really upset the rhythm of Jimenez. That effectively knocked him out of contention. Silva Santibanez grabbed third place, coming out of that last bend, and Jimenez knew he was beaten and his cause was lost. It was when he just tangled with Guzman, and Guzman managed to just hold his position. As I said, Guzman, very good when it gets gritty and physical in there. But all that was going on behind this man, Simon Albrecht, who once again skated as if he was the only man on the track. That really is the mark of greatness. You can be in a high-quality field and make it a one-man race. That's really special. Uh, high fives and congratulations from the whole team.
the coaching staff, the support staff. They get a big assist as well, of course. A medal for Venezuela and a medal for Chile and Colombia. Well, it's not been their event, has it? Fabriana Arias beaten into silver.